there is one festive scene in Holiday in the Vineyards. This film is also called A Wine Country Christmas and it doesn't really have any business calling itself a Christmas film. They clearly only put that one festive scene in there so they could market it as a Christmas film. But that aside, it's an okay film. This was released this year, 2023. It's directed by Alex Ravello, written by Cecilia Franco and David Zanardi. And it stars Josh Swickard as our protagonist, Carter. And we have Saul Rodriguez as Valentina. And Carter's mother sends him to this vineyard that's going to be sold. And his mother, well, his family, I guess, happens to own um, this large wine company and they're planning on buying out the vineyard, but the local vineyards are wanting to pool their money together and also buy it. So Carter's undercover job is to find out how much they're going to be bidding so that his mother can bid just a bit more of it at the 11th hour and get the vineyard. I feel like Carter posing as a carpenter was a bit ridiculous. I feel like how that's not convincing and I didn't believe him and I don't know how he thought he could pull that off. I won't say exactly what happens with that part of the narrative, but I feel like they could have come up with something a little bit more convincing than a carpenter, which is skilled work. He clearly didn't know what he was doing and it's very dangerous to construct things when you have no abilities. So that was a little bit awkward, but if you can overlook that, and overlook the fact that it's not a Christmas film, then it's okay. Not much happens. The film is mostly about Carter realising his mother is not doing the right thing while he also falls in love with Valentina. Honestly, the relationship between Carter and Valentina is kind of slow, and they don't get that much alone time together, so we don't really get to see it blossoming in a very convincing way. It kind of just sort of comes out of nowhere, but at the same time, I think as a pairing, they work really well. So I'm in two minds about how I feel about the romantic aspect. The Christmas aspect, I've already touched upon. There's one scene. Actually, that's a lie. I think I spotted a holly wreath at the fair, at the wine fair. And also one of the characters wears a Santa hat before that festive scene. But that's it. So if you're looking for a Christmas film, a film to get you in the Christmas spirit... A Wine Country Christmas or Holiday in the Vineyards is not one to go with. The narrative is okay. The pacing is okay. Not much happens, but at least it's steady and consistent. Carter is very likable. In fact, all of the characters are likable, apart from Carter's mother, of course. Brilliantly played by Eileen Davidson, a very well-written character, but obviously not very likable. It's generally a predictable film, but I will say there are things that happen towards the end that I hadn't expected, the way certain characters respond to things. And that's actually something that I liked. So I definitely think the film improved as it went on. Is it worth watching? Not as a Christmas film, but if it just sounds like your kind of film, if you like romance films, if you like films about vineyards, there are quite a few of them, then yeah, there are definitely enough good moments in it and enough likable characters that I'd say it's worth checking out but if you're going into it with the idea that you're going to be watching a Christmas film you're going to have a long wait to get to the Christmas aspect. Is it worth it? Yes I suppose it is. It's not a perfect film. It's not a Christmas film really but I think I still enjoyed it and I'd recommend it if it sounds like your kind of film.